Hi everybody, my name is Golden Miner, and welcome to a small game. Oh, sorry. Welcome to a small game. Does that picture just move? A small game called Full Steam Ahead. This game is available on Android. I just saw it on the App Store and was like, hey, look, it's a boat game. It's based in the 19th century. That guy's moving. He's a possessed ghost. So I decided to do this. I think that. I don't know who that guy is. I think it might be Brunel, but I don't know. Right, so we're gonna do a new game. Considering I never made a new one, but. I haven't done the new game. Oh, who should we give this guy? Oh, um, 19th century guy. A new voyage! Ladies and gentlemen, I invite you to explore with me the scientific and practical possibilities of a shipbuilding. We have n we have new opportunities before us, which can call upon the talents of your best young engineers. My name is Isambard is Isambard Kingdom Brunel. I was right. And although I have the three great ships to my name, there's always a possibility of progress. An event. Very wise. Oh, sink or swim. I'm guessing sink or swim. The hull is a watertight body of the ship. I think everyone knows that. You are tasked with creating the largest hull that can carry the most cargo without your ship splitting asunder. Prove yourself. Design ships. Hmm. Select your hull type. I want to go with the Titanic shape one. What? Sea sea worthy. Did you, did you know that we were here for? Um, did Bruno had an idea that passengers would travel from London Paddington Station to be designed on the Great Western Railway, a railway he had designed, to Bristol Temple Meads, another station he designed, all the way across the Atlantic to New York City in the fastest time possible. As trains as trains don't flow, he decided to build ships. His finest was the SS Britain, or Great Britain. Right, are we gonna? Oh, look! Oh, that's cute. I probably shouldn't. This probably wasn't the best design because it's gonna like go top heavy now. Oh, we look down there. It says we have four crates, five. Oops. Yeah, we got a star. Can we, can we get more stars? That ain't a good sound. Oh, look, and there's a little bar going up blue at the bottom. A uh, flood meter. That's cool. This ain't good. Come on, 17, 18. Get two stars. Okay. That will do. Okay. Good performance. This is commendable, although you might yet improve the design. Well done. Oh, we unlock two. Steady, steady as she goes. Make a ship which is stable, possibly as properly so that the first class passengers don't throw up their dinner as they cross the rough sea. Will this use this design? The USS Great Britain had, had three classes of passengers. First class were at the stern, where motion was less felt, but it would have been, but still would have been a wobbly tight ride. Second class were in the middle and the third were closer to the front where the ship broke through the waves. The third class fishing would have been the most unpleasant for passengers and the long voyage to Australia in, th in third class sometimes felt very sick. I'm not going to read all of this. Yeah, it's a little stormy in the background, that's cool. Can we stay stable? For 22 seconds. We balance. We got four stars. That's really good. Okay, we're losing stars. Come on, the sea. Got, oh, the sea had to get rough, isn't it? This game's rigged. It's designed to do this. Six, five. No, did we dare lose another star? Two, one. Yes. It appears you may have taken a few years study to make. It, it appears you may have, t have some talent a few years of study make an engineer of you. Show you a bit of a Scottish accent. But I don't know what Brunel actually sounds like, so I'm going to stick with the voice when doing him. Challenge. We've unlocked loads. A rate of knots. Nautical speed is the fastest. I unlocked a lot of stuff. 
Nautical speed is measured in unit of knots or nautical miles per hour. You must be the fastest ship within your power and test her me metal on the ocean. That deep. This one, we're gonna have a nice little block. I'm gonna go with engine. Oh, that's look cute, a little steam engine. Right. Coal. And a paddle. Seaworthy. Right, let's try this. This will probably stink because. It's not very nice, is it? It never goes smoke. Probably an option for that. I'm gonna see there's an option for that because I like stuff to smoke. Challenges. Ah, pretty. Right. Yeah! Design ship. Test design. Right, let's pop you up here again. Hmm? Ready to sail. There you go, much better. Full and there you go. Ahead. Full steam ahead! That's probably why the game is called that. We are going... 1.88 knots. It's part of 5. I probably should have paddled lower. Because paddles don't work if they're up in the air. They don't work if they're completely underwater. So you're just going to basically put a paddle on the side. And a paddle that can't be above water. It's just a windmill. And it has to be in water so it pushes it along. Our current speed is... Fast, this is 1.8 knots. That's just not too, just, just too short. This isn't a very good ship, guys, is it? Let's edit it. We're gonna put the end. We're gonna put. Can we change this up? Yes, we can. The master paddle. Yay, there we go. We're the fastest ship imaginable. Pretty imaginable, considering you can't make your own hole. Because that would be crazy, wouldn't it? Right, a test design. Oh, oh steam my head. <laughs> right. We've already beaten it. Can we get a third to get a second star? I can use it. There's little fish as well. They didn't have that in the other one. Yeah, it's not pretty, is it? It's boring. It's like a ship simulator. No, so it's just like a test design thing, isn't it? We're not gonna go any faster than that. Nah, we just went to our max speed. Come and have a... Come, you have some wit about you. Apply yourself to improve this ship. Challenges. No. The long haul. The SS Great Britain was constructed to have all the way from... from Britain to New York. Constructed of a... It wasn't that the Titanic? Britain to New York, but it sank. Design ship. Right, this size, there's nothing there. This size, you know, paddle, no engine, mahusive engine. Wait, we can actually change it. That's coal size, you don't want that any bigger. Right, we want the engine to be big. That's perfect size, too big. I'm being ridiculous, so guys. That's big enough. A bit of coal there. That engine's probably gonna have like eaten up like loads to make this coal bigger. Do we have an do we have money or anything? No, we don't have money, do we? This should work. If it don't, I'm sad. Boop. Hey, you see me now. Right. Um the in eighteen sixty doctor blah 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 blah. Full stream ahead! Is that literally how far we have to go? Just that flag. We've gone 30 miles in a moment. That's pretty impressive. In real life, I've probably walked about 10 inches. This ship must be absolutely massive if we've gone like that many miles. We 
have like lost all our fun really. Like we're redesigning this, it's too slow. I don't like it. I don't like it. It's too slow. Right, size to max. Yeah. That's gonna squid you up here. Nothing up here, is there? I'm not aware of. Just two things, sound and tip. Cold steam ahead! That's what, that's what the guy's gonna say. I'm, I'm imagining that's him. Wow, we're going fast. If we didn't rip off the boat. Apparently it does that. Well, we've gone about three times the speed we did last time. We usually have to get to that flag, don't we? That's going to be to New York, isn't it? Oh, that's just going to be one star. Let's go do this place. Yee. Yeah. I like all the fog. It's pretty neat. Eighty, ninety, nearly on a thousand miles. Can I get in there pumping? Oh, yeah, it's fast, isn't it? Oh, that's the one thing you can do. Yeah, it's fast, isn't You could, you could do worse, but let us instead do better. Perfect. Cruise control. Build a ship that crosses the Atlantic Ocean from Liverpool to Australia as fast as possible. Do not delay. Right. This one again. Oh, we have sails. How do these work? If you want to stick on top of it, or you stick them? Yes, you stick them in. Right, we need two little sails. We're going to SS in this. Right, we need like this. And we're going to have two little paddles. We're going to go super fast. No, please fit, please fit, please fit. But you dare not fit. It's got like a face now, with like an evil hat on. There's some Captain Matthew took the SS Britain for a trip to Australia and it tries to say he won the popular with the passengers. Oh, we need to hit the bottom then. Click to unfail sails. Did it make a sound? I don't know what you shouted then. We are going very fast. Oh guys, I'm probably going to cut this out, so we're going to be like here for like an hour waiting for this boat to work. It's going to go to the other side of the world. It's probably like four inches. We have a wind speed of one, these sails are doing nothing but causing us weight. And this engine's going to run out of fuel. Oh, we've got two now. This engine's going to run out of power now. I like this music though, it sounds like something that they play on Titanic. Or an opera. That's ready. Right, that's for what you know. Oh, by the way, look what I'm doing. I'm moving myself on the bridge. This is uh, right, the Golden Gate, but you can't really see it from here because I've got a tiny camera. Well, well done, because you're not going fast enough. We've got five wind speed though. 
Let's put it stop. Don't use it really. Ah! Rubbish. Right, move this engine. Get ready to make you massive. Put you there. Take you away. Take you away. Redesigning this. You go here. Car goes underneath. I'm not going to use sails because sails are useless. Even though if we do run out of coal, it's still pretty decent, isn't it? But we have a big enough engine to keep us going. Oh, that engine was big enough then. Do we fit? Do we fit? Yes, we fit. Right, it's so a seaworthy. Let's go. Don't forget to show your sail to show your to stow your sails when the wind is against you or they will slow you down. Full steam ahead. Oh, sorry, you've been attacked by paper. Oh, sorry this is a new background because Fury's upstairs doing something on the computer like homework or something or maybe a game or mask or something. Oh, I'm sorry about yesterday's video but it was like really dark. Because I recorded it in the day like this, and there was lovely sunlight coming in. But then what happened was. Sorry, I'm digging again. The what happened was was that it was um because it was it was dark and the light from up from from the light was um not on well, my bedroom light was shining on was shining on my screen. But if I move my head to a certain angle, you couldn't see me. And that it was, um, I mean, eight days. Oh, well, half a day. We've done eight percent. I'm not playing this level, it's stupid. Challenges. Let me guess. I don't like these ones. Get one more star. Single swim, steady as she goes. Great knots. In the long haul. Right, we're gonna design this ship. I mean, let's test it. We're gonna turn that it, it goes for ages. Because that's how we get stars, we can unlock a new level. But it's, I'm not doing that, I'll show you that level. How long am I recording for? I'm recording for 18 minutes. I'm probably going to wrap things up in a minute. Or we do what? We get that one star and do the other level, yeah? I don't think it's an interesting one. It's just going to bring you What are you doing? You probably guessed by what I'm saying. Righty ho, we're nearly there. 620 nautical miles. We're halfway there. Mm. I'm really bad. This game is not. This game is kind of a game you play when you're driving in the car. Well, not when you're driving. That's a, don't. Don't play with your phone when you're driving in a car. Or you're driving a car. Right, we're gonna get really far now to get another star because we have to get one star, we have to get another star and another star. Not just get one star, play the heavy game, get another star. One, 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 yeah. We're gonna have to get to that next little flag and we're out, we're out of coal. We're out of coal! Just please let the wind just drift you. Come on, let the tide drift us. We're not gonna make it, we're slowing down very quickly. Oh come on, that's good enough, isn't it guys? It obviously isn't, is it? End test. You could do worse when I try it. Okay, edit this ship and we're gonna put on 
and make it a bit longer. The plinky plonks, much longer. And we're gonna pop a sail in. And then we're gonna put a piece of coal in. This is a really odd shaped ship, but hey ho, that's the way our life heads us, isn't it? I'm gonna put an engine on. We only need to travel a little distance, we need to put it way too big. Right, move you. We can squeeze the engine in there. And put a tiny little coal pocket in. Maybe a bit too small. That's probably that's probably got got about four lumps of coal in it. That's probably enough to send two emails. Oh yeah, because that's actually proven that it takes um You're gonna fit please. This is a really odd shape ship. Sorry, we're gonna do a tiny little thing and put some we can put two in, can't we? If this phone cooperates with me. Ah, right, that's it. I'm bringing it to this level. Sorry guys. Am I like hovering over you? Right, this uh, we're not using this whole ship. We're gonna use this one. It's much bigger. And it hasn't got these weird angles on it, so you have to try and make everything a better size, do we? Right, so we're gonna put in an engine. Engine. Right, if you're gonna work for me. Right, and we're gonna put in a shale. Because everyone likes sails, because they're eco friendly. That's pretty much like, the only eco friendly thing about these ships. Is that they're um these sails? I think it was a bad time in the 19th century. Like, I think how much pollution there might have been. I just think that's a lot, isn't it? Sorry, I'm yabbing on. Right, everything must fit. You're gonna fit in, please. You used to, right, make you down a little bit smaller. Finally, guys. Finally. Raise oh. Laggy birds. I mean, you don't give it actually laggy birds. It's lagged so much you can't, you can't win. Can we just get a hamster to power, power it? Imagine that, a boat powered by hamsters, that'd be hilarious. But it's... We a new film, Hamsternator. The hamsters take over and put us in wheels that whip us to make power. That would actually be pretty dark. I'm getting yabbing on again, sorry. We need some driving our little boat, and we're gonna win this star, and we're gonna get the next video, and then we're gonna end it. Because guys... This is a, you know what, I might end the video here. I'm going to leave it a little bit longer, I'm going to leave it a little bit longer, because I want my videos to be at least 25 minutes, or half an hour. I want them to be like 10 minutes, because everyone likes long videos, because when you watch a long video, if you watch a 10 minute video, something really funny, or something really exciting you get interested in, but then it's just time to be jabbing on. This boat is really bad, I'm gonna, like, right. bite. Uh, oh, by the way, you know, this boat is the SS Britain here. Right, this one was too close for comfort. Tug of war. No matter, anyway. Thank you guys for watching. If you liked it, like it if you don't don't up to you but thank you guys for watching good bye, -bye. <laughs>